we're back at our Commonwealth property today. When we bought this property, we knew that the drain field was failing and we planned to put in a new drain field. We discovered that the ground was not suitable for a new drain field. So we're putting in something I've never used before, which is a septic tank that actually does all the wastewater treatment in situ in multiple compartments. So kind of interesting, get to see something new, looking forward to that. And here's the tank itself. It actually has multiple compartments where it does aeration and then UV treatment. Um, kind of interesting, and we'll be putting that in today. While digging, we ended up hitting a lot of rock. Don't know what that will mean or how that will impact the job. I guess we'll find out. The hammering is done. Rocks busted up. Looking good. Dylan with Hartman Excavating. They just finished installing the new tank. He's going to tell us a little bit about how it works. Alright, so this is the inlet side of the tank. That four-inch pipe coming into the aerobic treatment unit. And this is the trash compartment where all the solids and liquids from here. Toilet, shower, all that's going to go. Then it moves over here to the... Uh, it's got these plastic balls at the bottom and it breaks up all the solids, kind of makes them a little bit thinner, then it runs over here to the aerator unit where it's constantly blowing air into it, and that's going to, I guess, break it down even more, and then it shoots it back up through this gray pipe, back into the trash tank, then cycles through a few times, then hits this UV light, comes out clean. Well, there you have it. The septic tank installation is complete and this should service the home for a long time to come and we're able to solve the problem of not being able to fit a drain field anywhere. Looks good.